So today, my friends, I have something special that I want to share with you. <laughs> Look what I have here. I have, my friends, the amount of $200. $200 that I am going to spend on groceries and whatever else I can possibly find that I could take to the free food pantry in the south end of Yarmouth, Nova Scotia. I'm going to see what, how much I can buy, how much food I can buy to bring to that pantry today. So come on along my friends, it's another fun and very productive adventure. Joshua and I are back at the house and I can pleasantly say and happily say that I was able to buy a whole lot more groceries at Walmart than I ever expected. And I'll show you the receipt here. Okay, I had $200 to spend and I spent $194.18. That's what it came to. So it worked out beautiful. And so what I'll do now is I'll show you what Joshua and I bought and then Josh and I are going to take this down to the free food pantry in the south end of Yarmouth. To start with, Joshua and I picked up two loaves of the Great Value Whole Wheat Bread. And we have two loaves here. Ah, so two loaves. So I think this will come in handy to a couple families anyway. A couple fresh loaves of bread. We also picked up two boxes of macaroni and one box of the Catelli Fusilli. I think that's how you pronounce it. Pasta is always a good idea anyway, I think. And we also picked up two boxes of the Penne Great Value Pasta. These two jars here were on sale. The Garden Select Six Vegetable Recipe Country Mushroom Spaghetti Sauce. So that will come in handy, especially with all the pasta that we picked up. In the back we have quite a few boxes of the Great Value Macaroni and Cheese. And this is the original Macaroni and Cheese. This one is White Cheddar, so there's two of these and three of those. And this one is Extra Creamy macaroni and cheese and as you can see there there's two boxes for anybody who wants to make some soup we picked up this really nice soup mix and also this chicken broth here to go with it and for a couple people or a couple families that don't feel like making a soup there's two cans of tomato soup and two cans of well there's vegetable soup and chicken noodle soup as well. 
So there's four cans of soup right there. The tuna was on for a good price, so we picked up three cans. And in the back here, this is actually jam, strawberry and blackberry jam. So someone will enjoy that, I think, with their breakfast in the morning. The peach slices and the fruit cocktail were a great price. And in the very back, I have some one minute oatmeal. Very practical to have in the house. Joshua wanted to pick up some juice, so he picked out the Five Alive and the Minute Maid. Over here, we have some instant white rice, and there are two boxes there. And down in the front, we figured if somebody would like to make some chili, there's some red kidney beans and two cans of diced tomatoes to go with it. Oh yes, and the chili powder, in case someone wants to make some chili. For someone's breakfast, we have some pancake mix and some pancake syrup. And in the baking section, we have some white sugar, molasses, and this really nice package here of the bran muffin mix. So someone might enjoy having that in the house if they're in the baking mood. I also thought that someone might enjoy having this red lobster biscuit mix. And I've made this before. It's the Cheddar Bay Biscuit Mix. I've, I've had this before. I've bought this before. And these are absolutely delicious. So we thought some family out there might enjoy to have these too. Everybody gets into the snacky mood. So Joshua picked out these two nice bags of chips. And Walmart sells their chips for a very, very low and reasonable price. So sometimes I scoop them up whenever I'm in Walmart. And today they're going to the food pantry, so someone else will be able to enjoy these two bags. I've had the Mother Parker's Orange Pico tea before, and these are very, very, like this is a very good tea. So I thought somebody might enjoy having that in their kitchen cupboards. And also these Ben's Original Rice. This is the Chinese style fried rice, something easy for a busy day and there's two there. They were each about 97 cents each so I thought it was a good deal so we picked them up for the food pantry. I'm sure that plenty of people can say that they grew up having peanut butter in their household. I know I definitely can. My mother always bought peanut butter. We always had peanut butter in our house. It's terrific for protein. So today this beautiful container, this beautiful jar of peanut butter is going to the food pantry. In this section here, you can see I've got some toilet paper, some Irish spring soap. In the back, I have some Old Spice soap and there's 12 bars in that one. I have some palm olive dish soap, very practical, and a bottle of shampoo and hair conditioner. Now I must say when it comes to the toilet paper, what I'm going to do is I'm taking these rolls out of the package so that way more than one family can have access to those rolls of toilet paper. And I'm going to do the same thing for the bars of soap. There are six bars of Irish spring soap here. So I'm going to take this plastic off so that all six bars are loose and that way more than one family can take home some soap today. And I'm going to do the same for this soap, this 12 bars. I'm going to take it out of the package so that way more than one family, quite a few families, can come and get some bars of soap if they, if they need it. The last little bit of groceries I have here on my countertop. And I forgot to show you earlier that we picked up two of these really nice packages of gravy mix. These are always handy on different days when you make mashed potatoes or cook up chicken or different things like that. So I'm sure someone will enjoy them. And back here, right in the back, I have a box of Rice Krispies, or I guess I should say the Great Value Crispy Rice, which is just as good as the Rice Krispies, Kellogg's Rice Krispies. And we have the Multigrain Cheerios. Cheerios are excellent. They are actually a family favorite in this household. And I thought someone might like to have something like this. Some chicken strips. These are really, really good. And they don't cost very much either. Now on to the vegetable section. 
A lot of you know that our household loves vegetables, so I thought that someone visiting the food pantry today might like to have some vegetables too. So I stocked up, my friends, I stocked up. And you can see here that I've bought quite a few different packages of very beautiful, very colorful, healthy vegetables to donate today. So I'm happy to do it. I'm happy that we can do this today. And here in the front, I have some bags of mixed vegetables. There's three of this kind, three bags of peaches and cream corn, and three bags of frozen peas. So I think that'll help out a few families anyway. I'm going to pack all of this up in some grocery bags, my friends. I've shown you everything that we bought. I'm happy to be able to help out. I know Joshua had a really good time at the grocery store helping pick this out and pick that out. He had a good time. So it's been a good day. It's been a fun day and it's definitely for a very good cause. So I'll see you guys down at the free food pantry. I'll see you there. Joshua and I are at the free food pantry and this is just right across the road, the road from Fresh Mart here in the south end of Yarmouth, Nova Scotia. And anybody has access to this, it is free. Anybody who has needs can come here. So Joshua and I are gonna drop some food off. Joshua and I have emptied out everything that we had. All of the bags are emptied out into the food pantry. It was nice to be able to put things in the fridge, in the freezer, and in the cupboard where the shelves are. It's been really, really good. And it's been a good day, hasn't it, Josh? Yep. Yes, a very productive day, and definitely, it was definitely a very, very good cause. I want to thank you all for joining us here today, my friends. And if you like this vlog, please, Give us the YouTube thumbs up or press that subscribe button. That would be great. And we have more vlogs coming up. So stay tuned and we'll talk to you soon. Talk to you soon, my friends. Bye. Bye. Bye.